In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. This is Father Deacon Angel Palacios from the Mission of St. Andrew, Diocese of Mexico, of the Orthodox Church in America. The Gospel is for the 24th of February, 2019, according to St. Luke. But I say to you that, listen, love your enemies, do good to those who hate you, bless those who curse you, pray for those who abuse you. If anyone strikes you on the cheek, offer the other also, and from anyone who takes away your coat, do not withhold even your shirt. Give to everyone who begs from you, and if anyone takes away your goods, do not ask for them again. Do to others as you would have them to do to you. If you, love, if you love those who love you, what credit is that to you? For even sinners love those who love them. If you do good to those who do good to you, what grace is that to you? For even sinners do the same. If you lend to those from whom you hope to receive, what grace is that to you? Even sinners lend to sinners to receive as much again. But love your enemies, do good and lend, expecting nothing in return. Your reward will be great, and you will be children of the Most High. For He is kind to the ungrateful and the wicked. Be merciful just as your Father is merciful. Do not judge, and you will not be judged. Do not condemn, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Give, and it will be given to you. A good measure, press it down, shaken together, running over, will be put into your lap. For the measure you give will be the measure you, you get back. Glory be to thee, O God, glory be to thee. Well, what is very striking is that the Lord is asking us, if you love those who love you, what grace is that in you? What is it that the Lord is asking us, you and me, about? What is this grace? Well, the grace is the fruit or the presence of the Holy Spirit. That is the grace. Through the Holy Spirit, we are able to bear fruit. We are, you see, we are the earth. We are the land. And we, uh, we do not produce by ourselves. We need a seed. And the seed that we receive is nothing less than the gospel, the word, which it happens to be the eternal Son of God. That is to be nurtured in our hearts by the grace of the Holy Spirit. If we become so haughty, if we, became so, if we would become so prideful to think that we have done good things and have produced good things by our own will, then we become like the Pharisee who just tramples down even himself because he's so full of himself, he fools himself. Nothing good comes out of our, our own. We are like that earth that needs to receive the word of God and the Haris, that is, the grace of God to produce the good fruit. If we acknowledge that before others, notwithstanding that we do the deeds, or rather that God does the deeds in ourselves, if we give the glory to God, then we'll be blessed. Let us humbly pray to God that He might enlighten our minds and make ourselves able to be want to, want to be humble.